Well, Santee Cooper is planning to go greener in its integrated resource plan for the future. It's a plan every energy company has to review and present every few years. Melissa Rademacher talked to a Santee Cooper spokesperson about why they're focusing on a shift to different kinds of energy over the next decade. More solar power, natural gas, battery storage, and wind turbines are all a part of the Santee Cooper's updated resource plan. The company says each of these steps will help reduce their carbon emissions by more than 50% of what they were in 2005. Santee Cooper has already announced the retirement of the coal-fired Winya generating station. A spokesperson for the company says moving away from coal is a conscious environmental step and the closure timeline will coincide with the opening of a natural gas plant, allowing for community transition. The report still has to go before the State Public Service Commission for approval. A spokesperson says this plan is about efficiency and service, and the changes won't really affect the customer's access or cost at the end of the day. We had five different public hearings, public meetings over the past year, roughly, and um, had over 100 people participate in each one, um, including a number of customers, uh, re uh, residential customers. And so that inpu input did influence uh, part of the plan. Gore says Santee Cooper will release the full detailed report online once they've submitted it to the State Commission on Monday and there will be a public hearing later this year before the Commission approves their plan for people who are interested. Reporting in Charleston, Melissa Rademacher, Live 5 News.